Hey guys, okay, so why am I up here again? <laughs> well, this is the second half of our collaboration, so this is going to be a patriotic themed uh, video, but if you are not from America, that's still fine because a lot of the things that I'm showing, and I'm sure the same with the other three ladies, you can just switch to your country's colors or whatever, just make them for yourself. Or maybe you are in America, but you're not going to a 4th of July themed party. Just make these for yourself because seriously, it is some good stuff. <laughs> it's uh, for ours, the things that we're making, we make uh, for other holidays as well. So anyways, I hope that you guys will go and check out the other three ladies in this collaboration. And that is Sassy Lunch Mom, Cute Little Cupcakes Mom, and The Wads. All four of us are so excited to be doing this collab, and hopefully if things go well, they will want to do one with me again, maybe at the beginning of the school year. So anyways, I hope you guys enjoy this 4th of July theme. Oh my gosh, I like just about took out my face. All right, so we are going to make patriotic pretzels. I don't know if that's what they're called, but that's what we are going to call them. So you're going to start off by taking your pretzels and... Spreading putting, them? Yeah, spreading them out on your paper plate. And if you see a broken one... Like these? Yeah, just move them off to the side, and we will snack on those separately. Now, on top of these, you're going to take these little white candy melts. Here's what they were. Oh, geez, we're throwing them all over the place here. I do So, you're going to take these, and you're going to put one on each little pretzel. Okay, so we're going to go pop these in the microwave quick. Let's put your M&M's. Oops, hold on. I'll move them close to you in one second. And then you can... Oh, perfect. It's exactly where we want it to be. <laughs> so you're going to do one color in the center, and on the outside you're going to do like this. You can start your own. No, I'm going to eat this one too. But can you put whatever um, ones you want in the middle, like blue or something? Yeah, so why don't you do a blue in the middle and a different color on the outside? All right, so that is it. These are super simple. Wouldn't you say they're pretty easy to make, Bella? Yeah. Yeah. But I need my mom's help to do the white chocolate. Yeah, for the microwaving them. And then we just stuck them into this uh, star plate thing that we had got from the... Dinosaur? Yeah. And everything is there was I don't know. Yeah. And you can see I... You know, kind of purposely made mine into flower shapes, and I put the logo down. Bella used her imagination and did her own thing, and I think they all turned out beautiful. Yeah. So, what a fun little snack that we are going to be able to bring to a party, huh, Bella? Party! Yes! <laughs> so, next step we are going to do is taco dip. Oh, man. There is, like, a million different ways to make taco, taco dip. dip? But we are going to make it our way. Our way, yeah. So typically what I do is I um, mix the t sour cream and the taco seasoning together. But because I want the sour cream to be like the white stripe on the flag, I'm not going to mix the taco dip into the sour cream. I'm going to mix it into <gasps> the refried beans. Yay! Does that sound good? Yeah! Okay. Okay, so let's just season this beans up. Dose. You can totally skip this step. We have never actually seasoned the beans before, but I just thought, let's do it. What we're going to do is we are going to add a layer to the very bottom of our clean tray. So, just, oopsies. Scoop up some mixture and spread it out. So this is going to be my bottom layer. 
And I'm thinking I need to find something else to spread it with. Bella, do you want to find me like a spoon or a spatula or something? Oh, spatula. All right, next we are going to add salsa. And Bella chose this salsa. She wanted a runny salsa. I wanted a chunky salsa. So you can add whatever salsa that you prefer. Yeah, you can have chunky or like ice. Yeah, or kind of runny. But I kind of prefer mine like runny. So there's our layer of salsa. Super liquidy, so I don't want to add too much because I don't want this to make our dip really runny so there's that um, and then next we're going to add some guac and put it into a ziploc Bella went to grab me a scissors quick I am going to just fill my ziploc with some guac okay so now we have our guac in a bag and what do you think we're going to do with it Bella We'll spread it all over like a frosting. Yeah. First, we're going to cut a hole big enough that our block can fit. <laughs> and then we'll just give this a, a spread around. little bit of a spread. A round? <laughs> hey, if you and it's okay if it's not perfect, right, Bella? Yeah, and when we were... And if you ever guys went to Disney World and you waited a long line, this is kind of what it looked like. Oh, yeah. Wait, there's a little heart. Oh, the line's going through. Oh, there's a heart in the food. <laughs> this, <laughs> we went to Disney World last year, so mm -hmm. Bella knows all about waiting in those long lines, don't you? Yeah, but it's worth it. It was worth it. You are right. I mean, we had lots of fun. So I think next we are going to add some sprinkling cheese cabbage cheese. Cheese pot. Yeah, you can do this part. Okay, so now we are going to add some lettuce. Yeah. And now, I Bella, any big pieces of lettuce you can grab and you can... Munch on the zuts on. Okay, sure, you can munch. <laughs> but I was going to say rip up and make small. Oh. Okay. How should I do it, do you think? Mm -hmm. Like this? Quarters? Yeah. Okay. Okay, so I didn't know if I would have enough black olives. So if I don't have enough black olives to make the little star area, I will use black beans. But let's just see here. Yeah. And if you um, don't like black olives, then just skip this and just do whatever things you do like black beans. Or yeah. Or I was even thinking you could do um, those blue tortilla chips and just crush blue tortilla chips up. Tortilla <laughs> chips. <laughs> tortilla chips. Up and just put those right here. There's blue tortilla soups. Yeah. I would say that's okay. There's always room for improvement, but it's my first flag layer dip, so I am not going to be too hard on myself. And then we're going to do the stripes, the red and white. Okay, so I'm going to start with the tomatoes next, and um, I wish I could prop this up a little bit so you guys could see it better. There. Is that a little better? You'll never believe what I'm using to prop it up. Ooh. What is it, Bella? A banana. Yeah. My dog is really, really fast it's from that. <laughs> Oops, get in there. Okay, so there can be a stripe. Okay, so now I'm going to do sour cream. Um, yeah, we'll put sour cream on it. 
And I just put the sour cream in a baggie, like I did the guac. All right, so here is my American flag um, seven layer dip. So here it is from the side view, if you care about that. <laughs> and I love it, and I know why you call it seven layer dip. Why? Because there's seven layers, and there's lots of dips in it. Yeah, I don't know how many layers we ended up doing. Did anybody count? <laughs> All right, so here it is. We are going to do our craft, but first, Bella wanted to do these. Wacka I'm sure you've seen me do these before, but they're different ones. They're the milk today. It was cold. That was a cool one. Cold in your hand? Not really. Hmm. The other one just kind of. Woo! Ow! <laughs> Did it hurt? A little. A little bit. Well. <laughs> Oh yeah, it matches the wrapper. Okay, so we are going to do this wooden craft and all you need to do is buy just a few different kinds of ribbon. We bought two of each color. Yeah. Some is kind of fancy and some is just kind of plain. And then we bought these wooden dowels, um, another kind of ribbon, and you need these. Um, they are called screw eyes. Will I? So we are going to take these out and we are going to screw them in to the top of the dowels here. Yep. And then we're going to put on our thread or our ribbon. Got five of these guys done here. Um, some of them I was not able to screw in all the way, like this guy. Oh, this guy. But it's just hurting my fingers too much. I should have brought out like a pliers or something to help me. So. But I think they're in there good enough that they're not going to just fall out. And we open these so we can put them on. Yep, Bella ah. opened up the ribbons. So now we are just going to cut some ribbons and attach them to the dowels. But we have cut out each um, ribbon is one yard in length. And Bella has lined them up really nicely. And then I was getting to this stuff that I had bought. And... I realized it has a backing on the side, so they are sticky. So I was going to take them, um, the backing off, and then, you know, like push them together like this, so then they would stick to each other and it'd be a diamond on each side. So as I'm taking it off and trying to figure out, should I do that to the whole strand or cut them and then do them? Bella, what did you say? Um, hey, let's, I will go put those around to be the so sticky. Yeah, so her idea is why don't we just add this to the dowel itself so that it can have some sewage on it. Yeah. We'll just start in the wood Seriously, end. she blows me away with the way her brain works because he, here I'm going to be making it way more complicated than it needs to be, and Bella just comes up with a solution easy peasy. So I'm going to do it right now. Um, should we wait and do the ribbon first and then that, or do that first? I do this for so it would be kind of hard. Oh, once the ribbon's on, it'll be kind of hard? Yeah, I mean, then that's going to be dangerous. You're right. And then, I, then it would get caught. You are absolutely right. Okay, Brainiac. Okay. <laughs> so, Bella's going to show you quick what we did. We have all of our ribbon. It's kind of getting destroyed as we craft here. But she's put three in a group. And she's folding it in half. And now she's going to have a little loop at the very top there. So 
I get my finger out. And now she pinched her finger in it. So we are gonna take that little loop and we are gonna stick it through this, um, this guy, if it will focus. So you might have to pinch it and get it to really stick. And if only two make it, only two make it. We'll do the other one in a minute. There you go, stop. Take the white one out. Okay, so now we have this loop here. So now what you're gonna do, do you remember? Oh yeah. You're gonna put your ribbon right through that loop and pull it tight. And you got yourself a little knot. Look at that. Your first one, and then you just continue to kind of fill it up. So simple. And you just keep filling it up and filling it up. And here's one that I have done. Now this uh, rhinestone-y sticky stuff is not adhering very well. I think once we get home, we'll I'll probably just... we will gonna have to glue it. Yeah, we'll just have to put some hot glue on it. Once you've gotten quite a few of these on here, the little hole gets really hard to push more things through. So I ended up just tying around, um, I don't know, what do you call it, like the neck of it? So it just kind of made it a little bit more full. So I don't know if you can tell or not, but like this one, this blue one was just tied on and there's quite a few underneath there that I just tied. Okay, here they are. What can you do with them, Bella? Fireworks on a stick. Can I do this? <laughs> Ooh, fancy. I thought she was going to throw them. <laughs> so weird. <laughs> I hope you guys enjoyed these simple little snacks and this fun craft that we yeah. did. <laughs> and I really liked swinging those through and pretending they were hairs. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> but I hope you guys also go and check out Sassy Lunch Mom. Moms. <laughs> Sassy Lunch Mom. Sassy Lunch Mom. Cute Little Cupcakes Mom. Cute Little Cupcakes Mom. And the Wads. And the Wads! So uh, check them out and let them know that we sent you again if you missed them the first round of our little collaboration here. Yeah. Otherwise, thank you guys so much for watching again and for all the love on our videos. Yeah, and don't forget, give it a big thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe for all our videos you watch. Make sure you really subscribe and give it a really big thumbs up. <laughs> okay, Bella. <laughs> Bye, guys. Bye.